as we all know Eula and Albedo will be having their rerun happen at the same time these two banners will be sharing the same pity meaning if you do 60 summons on Eula's banner and decide to switch to Albedo banner you'll still have the 60 pity built up this is good for multiple reasons one thing i want to talk about is how it's going to change the future of genshin impact an obvious change is the fact that people are going to have far more opportunities to get the characters they want but i think that's pretty obvious another thing that i think this double rearing system might affect is weapon banners more specifically what weapon banners might be featured for example if Ganyu and Zhao rerun at the same time, maybe Mahoyo would put the Amos Bow and Jade Spear at the same time on the same weapon banner. I think this is makes sense because well it'll lead to more profits because not only would Ganyu havers be wishing for on the weapon banner, so would people that own Zhao. So you kill two birds with one stone. And I think this will also lead to better weapon banners because you're going to see far less weapons like uh, the Skyward weapons because those aren't the best in slot for any characters anymore. You're going to see more weapons like the Thundering Pulse, Ammo's Bow, Freedom Sworn, all these different weapons instead. So I think that's a benefit to the weapon banner. Another positive to having two reruns at the same time is the fact that it's going to be a lot easier to get the 4 star you want. Because typically on a banner, only 3 4 stars are featured. But with two reruns happening at the same time, that's 6 4 stars featured. So you'll have 6 4 stars to choose, ch choose between. So for players that are looking for a specific 4 star, they're also going to have more more opportunities to get the 4 star they want. I think there are a lot of positives to this new weapon banner system, but I also think there are a handful of negatives. One obvious negative is the fact that when two characters you want rerun at the same time, you're most likely going to be forced to choose between either of them. Or you're just going to have to spend money to get both of them. For example, I've seen a lot of memes, you could say, being thrown ab uh, around about Ganyu and Zhao rerunning at the same time and how that would be hell. And that's because a lot of people want both Ganyu and Zhao and they're going to be forced into a decision. So in a way, that's going to be kind of difficult especially for free to plays to choose between but that only really affects players when it's two reruns they want for example for me albedo and eula i don't really care about albedo if i were to go for any of these characters i would for sure go for eula but i don't have the primo so i'm not going for eula either that's just besides the point though i think that's an obvious negative that everyone should be aware of you're going to be forced into decisions more often i think another less obvious disadvantage of this double rerun system is the fact that for players that either are going to spend money or have money saved up to get two of the characters on the reruns at the same time meaning that if someone had enough primos to get both eula and albedo this player is going to struggle to build both of them at the same time because there won't be any time in between because since the reruns are happening at the same time that means there's less time to prep there's less time to just save up there's less time for everything because you have two reruns at the same time so even if you're a veil let's say you're a veil and you missed out on two characters the first time like you missed out on Yula and Albedo the first time now you're gonna have to build both of them at the same time and that's an issue but it's only really an issue if you're not patient if you're patient you can just wait to build one of them later all in all i think that even with some of the negatives i really think this is the right thing to do for mahoyo i think mahoyo's gone in the right direction about this for sure i'm really happy that uh this system has been added because 
the way things were looking we were gonna be seeing reruns for our favorite characters happen like six seven eight even nine months apart in albedo's case it's been a year since this last rerun so i think even with the negatives this rerun system is very much gonna make the game a lot more fun and interesting in the long term and the fact that the the two banners are gonna share the same pity is also fairly consumer friendly actually so good on mehoyo for doing this let's hope they can not make any more stupid choices <laughs> anyways guys if you enjoyed this video consider leaving a like and if you really enjoyed it consider subscribing bye guys